What's up StarCraft fans? When we last left off, Kerrigan met Zeratul, or rather, her fists met Zeratul, and then she met Zeratul's hand, and then she got somehow convinced to go to the birth world of the Zerg. Pretty standard business meeting. Zeratul somehow learned of a dorm dormant Zerg creature called the Ancient One, and Kerrigan didn't have a drop of skepticism about it, so she decided to feed the giant Zerg creature. The Ancient One has awoken, and now Kerrigan is on the path to reclaim the power of Zerus. But at what cost? Let's continue on Brutal and go back to Char. <sighs> I thought I already did these conversations. You have questions. The primal Zerg say the swarm is corrupted. What did the fallen Zelnaga Amon do to us? He desired our strength. The ability to steal essence. But we were independent. We would not follow. And so he bound the Zerg to a single overriding will. They lost their identity and became his slaves. The hive mind. That's Amon's corruption? It is. And a terrible fate for a strong primal Zerg. His mouth doesn't properly close, and he doesn't have a tongue. How can he pronounce words properly? Have you ever tried to pronounce the M sound without completely closing your mouth? <laughs> Do you know how that sounds like? <laughs> See? <laughs> That's what it sounds like if you try to talk like Zervan does. And, uh, let's try Isha now. My queen, why did we wake the Ancient One? Its power outstrips even yours. The Ancient One is key to unlocking the power of Zerus, and I need that knowledge. Will it not destroy us? It's called a gamble. It's something Terrans do when their instincts tell them the time is right. I see. Just as also when the Terran James money. Rayner came to Char, to return you to your original form. Yes, just like that. The thing about gambles, Isha, is that sometimes you lose. Actually, the, the key thing with gambles is that more often than not you lose. It's not just sometimes, it's more often than not you lose. We sprang from this primal Zerg, but they are so chaotic. All right, let's talk to Abther. New conversation. Primal Zerg. Unacceptable. Must be wiped clean. No trace left. Destroy Primal Zerg. What are you talking about? Saw ranged Primal Zerg creatures on battlefield. Based on Hydralisk. Primal Zerg stole design from Swarm. Swarm on planet for hours, days, already being replicated. Abathur, are you upset? Unacceptable. Swarm's power, ability to assimilate strengths. Primal Zerg must not take from us. Don't worry about it. They'll be on our side before I'm done here. He mad. He very mad. <laughs> Let's get some Mutalisk upgrades. Vicious Glaive. Mutalisk attacks bounce three more times, hitting up to six targets. This, this, this honestly sounds better. Overall, but for the next mission, I'll choose something else. Mutalisk regenerates 10 life per second while out of combat. Must remain out of combat for 5 seconds. Hmm, that's a pretty long time. Gains plus 9 damage for his armor targets. This is the one I'll get, an increase of 100%. For the next mission, this one will be quite important. Attacks no longer bounce additional targets. In, in co-op, remember, you can get all three of these at the same time. <laughs> That's pretty funny. That's what makes the Emula so strong if it weren't for the fact that they are like glass cannons. And they s 
splash damage hits Mutalisk so hard. Actually, let's get the... Uh... Actually, you know what? This is fine. Yeah, let's keep that. Let's see if Kerrigan got, Kerrigan got any upgrades. No, still these. Let's go to the mission then. Travel to the birthplace of the Zerg. There, you will be tested. You may be torn apart. If your rage makes you strong enough, the power of Zerus will be yours. Power of Zerus? How about the power of Protoss? <laughs> So yeah, this is this is why I wanted to do this planet before before uh, Calder. Ten more Kerrigan levels, and plus one Kerrigan. That, that's so much. That's a lot. So most, I mean, this is just a bonus. Sea unit spawns logos to attack ground targets from long range. Protect Kerrigan, and the mission is called the Crucible. Let's start it. Spine and spore crawlers can uproot, move, and then route to a new location. Seems pretty useful advice. You have come to this place seeking power. Power to kill Mengsk. Tell me what I must do. The power is more ancient even than I. It comes at great cost. What will you sacrifice to have your revenge? Everything. You must feel the power. It calls to you. Go to it. The Primal Zerg have been alerted to your arrival. They are coming for you. Abathur, send me the creature you've been working on. The Swarm Host. Adapted using primal essence, spawns locusts to kill enemies. Canonically, the swarm hosts, the swarm hosts are uh, are Abathur's creature. I can't imagine that they're happy. Or I can't imagine that, that Abathur is happy that the Hawk has creeper hosts. Destroy that Hydralisk. Let's try to spawn another one as fast as we can. Uh oh. Push ahead. Stun Get that. Going. Destroy Not that. Alright. Let's keep clear. going. Kerrigan's health is pretty low though. Oh wow. That narrow pathing. <laughs> Let's see if there's anything else in the way. I can actually, I can actually check out my base here. <laughs> Look at that enormous base, and the Primal Zerg just leave it untouched. What a waste! No wonder Abathur calls them failed. Even they don't even harvest a fully, uh, a fully available base. All right, let's move Kerrigan to the beacon, to the bacon. It's a pool. The first spawning pool. It existed before names. From this primordial place, the Zerg arose. Within, one essence split into many. One devoured another and became stronger. The first That's Zerg. A gigantic worm. See how large it is compared to the pool. You will have your power, and you will lose yourself. Evolve. Transform. Transcend. Recommendation. Avoid pool. Catalytic fluid will overwhelm Queen's body. Not strong enough. The Queen's hate is strong enough. And if I survive, it will remake me. I will become more powerful than the old Queen of Blades. Zagara, defend the Hive Cluster and the Chrysalis until I am done. Or dead. 
Yes, my queen. Fueled by hate. Oh boy. Anyway. So we have an actual economy right now. Let's uh, send everything to, min to minerals first because uh, we actually want to focus on minerals. For the first wave, we want to send everything here first because this is where the first wave will hit. And uh, we want to take our expansion as fast as we can. Send every send everyone here. Get more, get more, uh, get more drones. And this guy, as soon as it reaches here, I'm gonna start my expansion. There you go. That gotta be listened to a control group. Put that. Put down a creep tumor. The remnants of Brax forces gather nearby. They are preparing to attack the hive. Cluster. They're preparing to take the hive cluster. And crawlers by that entrance. Yes, mother. All right. Let's prepare for our first. Uh, for our first defense. Okay. They're sh they're just waiting around. All right. Let's spread out the creep. Get another tumor here. Standard queen here to uh, mass transfuse these guys. Yeah, mass transfuse is nice. <laughs> All right, let's uproot these guys. Move everything here on the other side. Spread creep. Get more larva. And now let's uh, start harvesting gas. You know what? I should make an extra hatchery. That sounds good. That'll, that'll, help me, that'll help me spread creep even faster. Put that there. All right, get our drones there. I should make some. I should make some uh, some overlords soon. But let's get a couple more static defense first. Yes, and the queen or two. The basin. Broken Zerg. Sure, go ahead. Get all the queens there. We're just getting a bunch of uh, a bunch of drones right now, just powering up. Maybe I should make another another spawning pool. The primal Zerg factions have engaged each other. Hmm. Get more overlords. That fast morph is really something. Get more queens. Let's get some uh some more drones. Do we have a spire yet? Let's get a spire. All right, let's get a queen here. Spread out creep even more. Actually, let's uh, let's, let's get back here. <laughs> let's hope our transfuse is enough. Okay, get more drones. Saturate that. I think that's enough. Yeah, that's enough. Now uh, let's get some overlords. Get more and get some mutilisks. Let's start getting our mutilisks. All right, time to move. Time to move their defenses back. Uproot that. Okay, now we now we have perfect uh, multiplayer level saturation. 
move our side defense back. See more, more Zerg coalescing there. Get level one, mutilisk upgrades or flyer upgrades. Get more mutilisks. Important. Essence collecting within pool. Can spread creep spawn many locusts to defend hive cluster from primal attacks. These primals are relentless. Spawn the locusts now. Kill them all. Make more drones and more mulisks. All right, spawn locusts. Defend. Essence collects quickly. Use frequently. All right, let's do that. Let's do exactly that. Get some static defense. Alright, let's move our defenses again. Back here. Get more mutilisks. I think that's enough mutilisks actually. <laughs> Mm, now let's get some drones here so we can uh, augment our static defense, and then uh, let's let's start making more swarm hosts. Move our spore crawlers here, or spine crawlers rather. Let's get more spore crawlers. And more spine crawlers. That's fine. We're fine. <laughs> we have enough. We have enough mutilisks. Send the storm hosts here. Are we in trouble? No, we're not. Oh no, a queen. I lost a queen. Oh no. Alright, now it's time to send our mutilisks down to this area. Get some more swarm hosts. We require more minerals. Cross the kill that one mutilisk. <laughs> so it doesn't uh, give us a lot of trouble. Have the patrol. Alright, let's kill this thing. Rally everything here, and <laughs> got that achievement. Let's go back. No simple matter. To reach it, we must cross the battle between Brack and Yandra's packs. Tyranosaur sample acquired. Will we All right. Primal essences further? To get some more. Now it's now it's time to mass. Oh, it's time to get more overlords actually. <laughs> All right. Oh, oh boy. Yeah, let's get more let's get more swarm hosts. Get level two. Oh, I lost a uh, I lost two. Wasn't actually prepared for that. Let's get some more drones actually. And uh, get more swarm hosts. Get a couple of queens here. Get some Belisks over here. To have some anti-air. Get more swarm hosts here. I actually forgot about the spawn locusts. Kind of wasting it there. Get the next upgrade. Alright, get some more drones, send them there, get two more, start our static defense over here, spread creep, like so, burrow that over there, hmm, we might need more anti-air actually, let's get another one here.
Get more storm hosts. Get the ones we have here. Get more queens. Oh, another another attack force over there. That's it's fine. I think we have more than enough defenses. We need our more queens. Spread it over here. Three of these spore crawlers. All right. Where are the queens I got? Okay, they're moving. Get more storm hosts. Move it over here. I should move this a little closer. Uh oh, pull back, pull back. Don't lose the mutilisk. You don't want to lose mutilisks. Especially since they're expensive. Get some more storm hosts. Oh wait, we're maxed out. That's awesome. Oh, uh, guardians have long range. <laughs> there we go. Okay, we have more dudes incoming. Ow, lost that. Bad micro. Just kill those bulisks. No, we're losing a. Uh, we're losing dudes. Get the armor upgrade. Get some more static defense. Burrow over there. Or root rather. Since the uh, they somehow don't burrow but root. That works somehow. Get some more swarm hosts. Actually let's spawn the locusts. I should use it more. <laughs> I should use every single attack wave. It has a very short cooldown. Oh, where are they going over here? <laughs> They're just wasting themselves. Get some more anti-air. Speaking of anti-air, let's get some more. Let's get some more static defense in general. Sounds like a good idea. Put one over here. Uh. Wow, placement. <laughs> let's get our storm boosts here. Mm, actually, let's put another one there. There. Move these guys over here. The primal serve are destroying the rocks near the crystals. <laughs> rock slapping, literal rock slapping. Let's there be list of target fire the hydralisks, like so. Now, what else can we get? Get more Sormos, I guess. Alright, another pincer attack, and I'll have the spawn locusts up this time. <laughs> Don't worry about it. I got it. I got this. I got this. I got this. Alright, spawn. Okay, locusts are gonna meet those other guys. Oh, it's nice that they don't have detection. Oh, pull back, pull back. <laughs> oh, I lost these swarm hosts just dancing around and stuff. And stuff. <laughs> oh well. Pull back. Some more storm hosts. It's nice being maxed out. <laughs> Don't have to worry about macro. By the way, check this out. Strange creature. <laughs> Alright. Spawn locus will be up again soon. That's perfect. Okay, let's, let's destroy these rocks or storm hosts can help out with the defense. Yeah, got these guys here. Oh, okay. There's another attack wave over there. Gathering. Let's wait for them to. Let's wait for them to arrive before using our spawn locusts. Root these. Come on, root. Everybody, root. 
And go. Let's try to use those locusts as much as possible because they are free units, literally free. Just off a they're ba they're basically a top bar. So far I haven't been using them as much as I should be, but now I am. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. They're so good. It's a, sh it's a shame I haven't been using them as often as I should be. Alright. Now let's uh, get another swarm host, actually. Oh, these guys are stuck. <laughs> Still stuck? Alright. Get in here. We claim essence. We give our. The broken Zerg remain. Collect their essence. Kill. Hey. The Andres forces are gathering. They are converging upon the hive cluster. Should be fine. Oh, get this here. <laughs> Alright, this is the last wave. We're 20 seconds away from getting another spawn locust wave. Destroy these. All right, use it. Destroy that guardian. Okay, destroy this viper. Okay, never mind. <laughs> See what else needs to be destroyed. Oh, ooh, epic meal time. Got an achievement. Nice. What else is here? Not much, apparently. I think this is the last minute? Yeah, hey, one more minute and then we're home free. Alright. Let's find more area to, to snipe this guardian. This guardian is a prime target for sniping. There we go. I think we did it. One minute remaining. Well, not quite. Not quite did it yet. Get another swarm host. Time to get more stag defense. Just in case anything breaks through. Yeah, spam. Spam all the stag defense we can get. <laughs> oh, there's a viper there. 40 seconds. Uh oh, we're actually falling. Let's get more mutilisks. Run! Get stuff, get anything! They're actually breaking through this side. Don't let anything touch the chrysalis. Spawn locust. Let's go, let's go. Four seconds. Alright, we actually did it. <laughs> Alright, nice. It's raining on Korha? Did you see how barren that place is? <laughs> look at that! Look at look at those achievements, though. I actually got the achievements this time. <laughs> Complete the crucible without Kerrigan's crystals taking damage. Oh, I did that! Epic meal time. All right. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I got all these achievements, and I think it's time 
Wait, wait, let me see. Spawn locust kills 93, and the achievement was 75. Ooh, that was actually pretty close. Enemy troops killed. Damage taken by Chrysalis, 0. Largest desert force, 124. Tyrannosaur lived 13 seconds. RIP. You was killed by Tyrannosaur, 0. Alright, uh, I think it's time to continue. Isha, what is the Primal Zerg doing on my Leviathan? I am Dehaka, one who collects. I kill. I take essence. Now I come to you because I feel your change. All Zerus feels it. All Zerus fears it. And you. But you don't fear me, do you, Dahaka? You shine. You shine. will bring more essence, and I will follow. When you do not, I will not. Well, I forged alliances on shakier ground than that. Very well, you can stay. Betray me and I'll collect your essence. Yes. That it? She forged... Grounds on shaky alliances because she has the plan, and now she doesn't know what's gonna happen if she let the hawk lets this uh, not not giant Godzilla creature into her pack or into her swarm. Anyway, let's uh, watch some conversations. Do you think the remaining pack leaders will join me now? They are a rock, a tree, a hill. They will stand against the wind. They seek power. And you? I am a river. I will flow. I seek essence. Will the pack leaders have no chance against the swarm now? They gather essence for thousands of years. They are blinded, but they are not foolish. All right, wise words. Let's watch Zagara. I look like the leader of the swarm now. Perhaps this will help bring more brood mothers back into the fold. You were the true leader of the swarm yesterday, and you will be tomorrow. Your appearance does not matter. Perhaps not to you. The Terrans will not be so understanding. as if I can rip worlds apart. And are you the equal of Aemon, who once controlled you? He never controlled me. I felt an influence. A trace of something dark but long gone. Aemon must have died before I was infested. I hope it is so, for he truly could rip worlds apart. Still can't get over that mouth action. <laughs> Let's talk to Isha. You radiate so much power. More than the old Queen of Blades ever did. Everything is different. I could always hear the swarm, control it. But now, I feel the swarm. Now I am the swarm. You basically stole Zagara's line. You know that. <laughs> Hmm. Genetic strands different. Restructured from base level up. Stronger than Queen of Blades. Sequences complex but clean. Completely different at core. Yes, I am different. I am my own master. When the Zelnaga artifact made me human again, it cleansed me of Amon's influence. And that allowed me to become something greater. Must take sample. Study new sequences. Don't even try, Abathur. What I am now is beyond your comprehension. Difficult.
difficult to admit. New structure beyond understanding will return to work. Nah, he's just uh, he's just like <laughs> he's just letting Abathur or er, he, he's just letting Kerrigan win. He can totally understand that. He can totally understand that. Let's see what we have for the swarm host. Burrow. Allow swarm hosts to burrow. Well, burrowed swarm hosts cannot be seen by enemies without detection. Able to spawn locusts while burrowed. Locusts spawn 20% faster. Rapid incubation. I probably won't use swarm hosts a lot. Locusts can attack both ground and area. This uh, this sounds like the best one, on, to be honest. Especially later on. But in the next mission, I don't think I'll have swarm hosts, so it doesn't actually matter what I choose. In the next mission, I won't have any units, so I won't actually have any choice. Hegos transformation has granted her new abilities, and they cannot be altered at this time. Alright, that's fair. Uh, that's it for the current mission. I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you for watching. If you have an idea for it, also can you please leave that in a comment. And I'm not sure if I'll have a campaign video out next week, because it might be Tychus's, uh, it might be Tychus's time to shine. But anyway, see you.